What's up guys, FIFA Point by here. Today I'm going to be showing you my player of the year investment and the reason why I've chosen to invest in this card as I feel like it's no risk and could turn a big profit. The reason I like this investment so much is that even if it doesn't pay off tonight with the Van Dijk and Sterling SBCs, then in a week or two when Mbappe gets his inevitable French player of the year card, he'll rise up in value then. The player that I'm talking about is the 87 team of the knockout stage, Olivier Giroud, and there's a few reasons why I think this is a good investment. If we take a look back at some of the Player of the Year Salah SBC requirements from last year, we'll see the Florentina and Roma SBCs both require European Man of the Match cards, so an SBC this year requiring a European Special card wouldn't be far out of the equation at all. If we take a look at the footbin index for the cheapest non-inform 87s that are available on the market right now, the cheapest outfield Premier League players are selling for around 28,000 coins. As you can see, this team of the knockout stage Giroud is actually the cheapest Premier League outfield 87 available on the market right now, and you can quite easily snipe him for 25 and 26k. The thing I really like about this Giroud card is the sheer amount of links that he has over the likes of Lukaku and Sanchez. You can link him to all of your free French League SBC players that you got by grinding bronze pack method. You can also link him to the likes of the new 88 Benzema and you can also go down the Italian route and link him to the likes of Jorginho and then link off with Chiellini and Buffon. The other thing I like about this Giroud card is because he's no longer in packs, there's already a limited amount of him available, and as he's needed in SBCs, his price will just keep rising and rising and rising. Combined with the fact that 87 rated cards are the cheapest have been in absolutely ages, and the fact that even if he's not needed tonight, then he'd more than likely be needed in the Mbappe player of the year SBC, I think this is a no-risk investment which could net you a lot of profit. If you enjoyed this video, smash the subscribe button to get information on all of my future content and let me know in the comments below who you've chosen to invest in for the Player of the Year SBC. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Peace.